Lieutenant Governor Yvonne Pretner Solon. Hello, I'm Lieutenant Governor Yvonne Pretner Solon. I want to thank you for participating in this important training. By learning more about Minnesota's new Olmstead plan and how it will impact your work, we can more effectively implement it. First, it is important to know this is not Minnesota's first time reforming service delivery for people with disabilities. In fact, Minnesota has long been a leader in the field. Minnesota first began reforming the way it delivered services to people with disabilities more than half a century ago. In 1949, Governor Luther Youngdahl burned a large pile of straitjackets, cuffs, straps, and other restrictive devices at the Anoka State Hospital. It was a watershed moment in Minnesota history that led to significant and meaningful policy improvements in the way that we care for, educate, and integrate Minnesotans of all abilities into our communities. Since then, our state has dramatically reduced the number of people in institutions. In the 1960s, Minnesota's state hospital system cared for 16,000 patients per day at 12 large state hospitals. Today, fewer than 500 Minnesotans are receiving treatment in the remaining large state-operated treatment facilities and more and more Minnesotans are now living independently or in caring group environments. Our new Olmstead plan continues to build on these past reforms to make further progress. Working with Minnesotans with disabilities, disability advocates, and other stakeholders, we develop this new plan to guide us toward a future where everyone is living, learning, working, and enjoying life in the most integrated setting desired. To achieve our overall goals, we must make progress in several sub-areas. Employment, housing, transportation, supports and services, education, health care, and community engagement. By providing better choices, access, and opportunities, we can dramatically improve the quality of life that Minnesotans with disabilities enjoy. To accomplish these goals, we all must make a coordinated, concerted, statewide effort. Minnesota's Olmstead Plan goals are connected to concrete actions that have been assigned to various state agencies. Even if you've not been assigned a specific action item to complete, every state employee has an important role in the success of Minnesota's Olmstead Plan to ensure that people with disabilities are enjoying life in the most integrated setting desired. Thank you again for attending this training and for your work every day for the people of Minnesota. I look forward to implementing these important reforms with you during the coming months. Lieutenant Governor Yvonne Pretner Solon.